town hall is that it was first built in 1863 and it's uh, been um, having a mayor of Grimsby but since 1201 when King John gave the charter to Grimsby but the actual building itself has been in use since 1863. Uh, my name is Helen Wilkinson I work on reception downstairs at the uh, main desk at the town hall. This room is the council chambers. Um, it's used for mayor making. Uh, when we introduce a new mayor every year, this is where it's all done. Um, we also have full council here, where all the council members get together and make decisions for our town. The town hall provides quite a numerous uh, list of services for the general public. Um, they can come in here and hold functions, uh, private functions, dances, dinners, that sort of thing. Um, but we also have uh, a bit of history with the place. And that goes back to, again, from the start in 1863, when it was a police station. I believe the town hall, as a venue, helps to bring communities together um, because it's in a central focal point of Grimsby. Um, obviously, the town hall is, is a, a monument there um, for the people to come and see and, and use. Um, this room is the assembly room. It's used for many things. Um, in the day, it's the meeting rooms. And um, we also use it for private functions, uh, weddings, um, and um, any birthday parties, engagements and things like that. Um, also, it's used for um, our main event, which is for mayor making. Once the mayor has been introduced and made mayor of Grimsby um, in the council chambers, there is then an event um, at St James's Church, and then we all come back to the town hall and uh, there's a buffet provided. This room is the banqueting room. Um, it, this is also held for meetings in the week, but when you hire our room externally, um, the banqueting room comes with the big assembly room. Um, the banqueting room is used for the bar area and for any catering and things like that. Um, so most people just mill around in this room here, um, get a drink and then uh, they go on to the assembly room. Yes, uh, the regiment that uh, came to Grimsby in uh, March of this year is the Royal Anglian Regiment and they just finished a tour of duty in Iraq uh, and Afghanistan. So they have got the freedom, the actual regiment, uh, the Royal Anglian Regiment, have got the freedom of the town. And uh, it's uh, important that we, we keep hold of that and recognise all the achievements that our young soldiers are doing out in when they're fighting the wars that they are at the moment. response from the general public is exactly what I would have expected from them um, to recognise the achievements that our young soldiers have, have done in the wars that haven't. So it was nice to see so many people gathering outside the town hall to see them march past. I think that the popularity of the town hall is quite important, uh, as I said earlier, that uh, it's got such a, a vast range of functions and, uh, and things that you can do at the town hall, and I'm sure that uh, that will help with the popularity of it.